seconds away from the, the big surprise I was telling y'all about, but I can't find the shop I'm supposed to be at. So I'm literally out here revving my engine so they can hear it and tell me where to go. Taylor said bust the right, right? On the main road, he said it's not up here. He said go all the way to the back. Got some good acoustics over here. Yeah. That thing is clean. Yeah, and then that's an UK60 if you do without the brake light, then they want something and they want the brake light. I don't know why. It's like fat, man. That's the that's the mythical part about fighter. It's a bad. Yeah, like some, everyone wants a brake light diffuser, yeah. and then now I know one wants it, or like half the people don't want it. Yeah. So now they want this though. Nah, it is clean though. See, so you literally just and the the Q60 hoods are here too. It's just it's too cold to unpack. Oh, so you literally every day come in here, see what you got, unbox everything. Yeah, weekends is like yeah. I man, it used to be where I can have like the weekends off. You yeah. know? I even have on my hour like out weekends off. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but man, it's like this is this is everything on the weekend. Packing all the large stuff because like half the business like the LED logos right, and stuff yeah. that pays the bills, steering wheels and stuff. That's I can pack in my house, but all this uh, stuff I got like higher family because this is a lot of work. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. So, no. it's, it's a learning process. So gang, that was the surprise, right? So a lot of you actually don't know who Holisco is as a person. This is Holisco Carbon Fiber, the one man <laughs> guy behind the entire operation. So as you guys, it used to be a three of us. Oh, well, my bad. It's three people, but three people that service like literally the entire United States. Anybody who has a Q50, Q60 is coming to this guy. So as you can see, gang, the whole restock is coming. So so just be on the lookout. Make sure you turn on post notifications for my page as well as for Lisco's page because it's coming very, very soon. As you this, can see. This, this half the shipment. We got another shipment that's twice the size coming this week. So. That's insane. And just for you guys, the Q60 guys, look, check it out. Q60 trunk. I'm pretty sure he has at least two or three more of those coming. Got the new, uh, oh yeah, get that carbon in there. That's good. Got the new Q60 rear diffuser without the brake light. So, anybody who doesn't want to have the third brake light, definitely hit them up. So, stay tuned, guys. A lot of stuff coming a lot. And Lexus IS and then Tesla Model 3. So. Oh, that's fire. So, anybody with a Lexus, hit him up. He's, damn, that's going to be dope. Bro. Yeah, exactly. Lexus is like in popular now. Yeah, I was talking to the guy here. It's like, I don't want to be known just as a Q50 person. Yeah. I mean, it pays the bills, but it's, it's good. True. It's good money, but like, you want to expand the market a little bit. Yeah. Because, um, yeah, yeah, man, it, it, it does good, but then you'll get people hitting you up and you feel yeah. kind of like a sucker. Like Seeing everyone else exactly. make all this money in the yeah. head, right? Like, I just take over. If I did this in Q50 yeah. in like one year, you know? Literally one year. Yeah. That's like, crazy. Yeah. How did you get in the car? Did you buy like a Q50 and was like, I want to, you know, customize it? Or like, how did that so that's, that's the, like the dumbest mistake I tell young people is like don't buy a car you want. Yeah. I, I was a, uh, in school for physical therapy okay. and I had an old 98 Maxima that broke down. Oh, shit, yeah. And, and my, uh, I don't know if you're familiar with Chicago and stuff like that. Yeah. So I was from Berwick. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. And, yeah. and my clinical for physical therapy was in Plainfield. Oh. And my car broke down. I had no car. Yeah. My parents divorced. I was basically on my own. Yeah. And, and my dumb idea, I, got, I ended up getting a maximum financing at like 11%. <laughs> so yeah, I got stuck there. And then once I, I, I went to physical therapy, I got my license and everything. Yeah. I was going to get a little bit of money. And then I was going to get the Q50. Okay. But dude, that still left me with so much negative equity and stuff. Yeah. So I always tell young people, like, don't do it. But I say it's not a mistake because that's what got me learning about carbon fiber stuff. I saw everyone like selling carbon fiber and yeah. Yeah, everyone knew that it was imported, but no one would say, hey, it's from China, Japan, wherever, yeah, whatnot. Yeah. And, and uh, yeah, it just started from there. No one wanted to share like, hey, this is how I sell it. And yeah. they were charging like crazy prices, like a steering wheel that I sell, which is kind of like my bread and butter, my yeah. business. They were selling like at seven hundred dollars, dude. And I got that price down the first year that I started doing it down to like three twenty. Yeah, you probably went crazy. Yeah, I went oh, crazy like selling. I think when we did group buys, I think I ended up doing like one hundred fifty in three months. One hundred fifty yeah. wheels in three months. Yeah. But I didn't charge any profit. You know, that's how I started with the yeah. community. I'm like, hey, you know, I can order this for you. I'm not, I'm not asking so any profit. So you your main person credibility. Yeah, and I wasn't even thinking yeah. out of business like that. Yeah. It wasn't until like uh, we had like financial issues with my wife, and then yeah. she had health issues, and then like I was having mental health issues too. Yeah. And I was like, dude, I gotta do something different because. Yeah. You know, physical therapy is like decent money, but you're not ranking, ranking six figures, like right? Forty thousand a year. That's See, yeah, yeah, that's not like an enjoyable. Yeah, and I went to school for three yeah. years, like struggling, yeah. struggling for that. Yeah, loans and stuff. Yeah. So then I just hopped on Instagram. I, I didn't know anything about like marketing or anything like that. So I was just saying, hey, you know, post here, post there. 
Um, and that's how I just snowballed for like a year and a half. Yeah. I was telling you right before the camera came on yeah. that we did like 300,000 in sales just off Instagram that's DMs crazy. only. Yeah. It's not my profit, it's just sales. <laughs> but still, just to do that off Instagram DMs, one guy by myself, I, 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 I didn't know to be proud about that until like I got the website in 2021. When we got the website, you know, for like uh, beginning of October, that's when everything like blew up a lot. It's that's so much easier, crazy. you know? Yeah. Cause like it takes the orders when you're not there, like essentially. So like yeah. in the morning, for instance, do you wake up to a queue of orders you gotta fucking fulfill? Sometimes it, it'll That's be, it'll crazy. be maybe if you make like a post, yeah. someone makes a post, yeah. <laughs> my Shopify store fills up and oh, stuff like that, okay. and, and it'll it'll be like that. So it'll be usually on Fridays, and I think it's because when people get paid. People get paid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So it'll be like that, or if I got a discount code, like I sell out, or if like the front lips. That I restocked like 30 of them. Yeah. They sold out like crazy. But yeah. usually it'll be slower things like the like the bigger items are more expensive. Obviously, people aren't gonna buy them like crazy. Yeah. But usually my cars always feel like with LED logos, mirrors, yeah. steering wheels. That's like the bread and butter. It's this stuff yeah. that I'm just getting into that people are realizing, you know, he's got it. So is it easier to get like the LED stuff in? Like yeah, just because it doesn't have to be made per se. Yeah, it's gotta be. I mean, it's in my home office. You know, oh, so, so it's right there. Yeah, okay. it's like a, like yeah. a little room, so I could just pack it there. It takes time, but it's yeah, like a lot cool. easier doing that than trying to organize this. Because if that gets lost in shipment, one hundred fifty bucks, I'll cover it, whatever. Yeah. But if something like this, that's like a, a trunk or a, or a diffuser, that's like five hundred, a thousand, two thousand. That's yeah. That's a little different. That's crazy. Okay. Yes, sir. Got some merch package. So I am officially sponsored by my guy, Jalisco. So be on the lookout for the discount code. We're going to finalize all that good stuff so I can get it out to you guys. But it is official. I am backed by the Carbon King himself, Jalisco. Come shop. Y'all see the restock coming. Oh, so, uh, orders a merch bundle. Yeah. Okay, it's an entry to a raffle for 300 bucks. Oh, yeah. $300 you could get. That's almost more than the Fuser card. <laughs> so you can pay, what, 100 bucks on top of that? 150 to buy the yeah. Fuser? So, be on the lookout, gang. Oh, it's still carbon fiber. Take it over. All right, guys. So, he just blessed me with some carbon fiber sea blades. So, he hooked it up. Yes, sir. So, he's going with the sea blades first. We got the shift knob coming soon. So, definitely stay tuned for the discount code. It will most likely be live by the time you see this video. Sheesh. Later that night. All right, gang. Just pulled up. Uh, meeting the dude over here for the undershroud. At a, at a Walmart, uh, you know, just to be in the public places so, you know, we safe and whatever. And I remember back in the day, I don't know if any of y'all, like, used to be sneakerheads or anything, but back in the day, like, I used to be a sneakerhead. Kind of still am, whatever. But we used to meet up anywhere to just trade shoes or sell shoes, and we never had to worry, like, you know, oh, this guy gonna rob me or this gonna happen. Like, all the broke boys ruin everything for everybody. But anyway, so, had to drive me, do that Walmart. So I'm about to text him, let him know I'm here. And uh, yeah, I'll show y'all the undershot once I get it. Look at the stars. <sighs> Got the undershot in the trunk. So now I'm about to head over to Eddie's crib so we can get the undershot put on. Uh, diffuser extensions. Um, I told y'all a low pressure fuel pump. But the brand of this undershot is TBW. So he said it does fit an all wheel drive Q60. Um, it uses all OEM bolts and stuff like that. So we'll see. I mean, if it doesn't work, that would be kind of, that would suck because I just paid for it. But, you know, I'm trusting people. I'm trusting people. Like, I'm trying to, you know, always think positive. So hopefully he didn't scam me or nothing. But I looked at the undershot. It, it looks like an undershot. So we're going to see. So, yeah, I'll holler at y'all when I get to Eddie's. Um, he lives, like, fairly close to Brian. So y'all know it's going to be probably, like, it's an hour from my house. But I'm a little bit closer to where they stay. So it might be 30 minutes. I don't know. But I'll holler at y'all when I pull up. I'll stick around it. What's going on, gang? Just pulled up to Eddie's. And, um, well, shit's everywhere. Nah, but he's painting. It's pretty dope, man, I ain't gonna lie. Oh, we got Taylor. Y'all know who that is. What's good? So I'll hit you guys up. Depending on what we do next, I don't really know. But we're painting, and I'm eating jalapeno chips. So see you when I see you. I never freaking knew that. What? <laughs> Hey, lying, bro. I had to see that video. Ain't no way. Yeah, we're gonna have to do it out of the cell video. Damn, I don't. I'm know down. What gas did you put in? <laughs> he put a fucking. Jeez. <laughs> that thing is so loud. What the fuck? Oh, fuck. 
No way! <laughs> that, shit, that shit is so clean. Dude. <sighs> Do. You just go up at high in RPMs and let off. See, I would always go up to like 4,000, 5,000. You gotta get up to like five, 6,000 and yeah. then let off and fuck it just starts going, bro. Oh my god, I never knew. Dude, my Bro, you guys oh. had to be jumping up and down. Oh bro, we god. were. Yeah. We Fucking were. Here, jump. Sure, jump in with me real quick. You gotta do it inside. You gotta hear it from inside. Jump in with me real quick. All right, bet. Hurry up. Oh, fuck. <laughs> How's it look from the back? Bro, insane. I'm gonna show you the video. It's fucking crazy, bro. Straight up GTR. What's going on? Finally got the car in the garage. Yes, sir. So Taylor, y'all know who this is. What the hell? Bro, why is the back seat coming out again? You already broke something? <sighs> Fuck. Second time it comes out. Weight reduction. No, third time it comes out. Yeah. <laughs> what are we starting with first? Low pressure uh, fuel pump? Yeah. Bro, that's. Look how easy it is, dude. <laughs> I just don't like how long it is. Yeah, well. <laughs> you don't like what? Like how long it is. <laughs> here, video down here. Long. Oh, nah. You're gonna give me yellow it work. Was either, like, <laughs> give me a purple light. You want a purple? No, for real. I got you. For real. All right, gang. They're talking about my uh, import kings. I can't pronounce the word. Y'all know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about? How do you say that name? Hold up. Oh, that I thing. Never heard of. <laughs> Whatever. The little handle joint. I seen you tag them though. Yeah, I got it from Import King, so I'm gonna have to get some for the game. Bro, where you going? It's got my gas in there. The, uh, light on. He got my gas on lean in there. I how I'm pulled to drive. <laughs> <laughs> start drinking and shit. Man, I like the same thing. What's the difference? Loki, that's clean. You clean that by hand? Yeah, by hand, bro. No, like for real. For real. Not for even real. To be funny. All right, you see how this one's stretched and this one isn't? Yeah. That's how you can tell it's got a high pressure fuel pump. Well, a low pressure, pressure fuel now. pump, but a bigger one right. than that one because that one fits normally. That one you got stretched. Oh, that's what you were saying. It's gonna take you like an extra fifteen minutes or something yeah. like that. Bro, that's dope. And it's clean as fuck. I appreciate. It. See, that's why I go to Taylor. He takes pride in what he does. Look how clean that is. That's care, bro. That's care. <laughs> all right, these are all the tools he used to change the pressure. Eight millimeter, a ten millimeter, a screwdriver. That's it. Really, that's it. Okay. <laughs> Shit's crooked. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you just chilling back there. <laughs> hey, buddy, you comfortable? Hell uh, yeah, bro. <laughs> bro, you want me to turn on the lights for you? <laughs> sure. <laughs> no way, it's straight. That's gang. Ain't that crooked? <laughs> Let me see. That's crooked. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Straight as a lie. <laughs> okay. Bro, what are they, what are you doing? Oh my god. You got what? What did you get? Yo, come here. Yo, it is the next morning gang. So we was literally at Eddie's crib. My garage is so dirty. We were literally at Eddie's crib for like I don't even know. I got there at like eight o'clock. I didn't leave until 140 something. I got home at like two two thirty but uh we did not have long enough self tappers to put on the diffuser extensions 
So we did take off the OEM mud flaps. It honestly don't look that bad without it. It looks weird like in the back, like over there. Like the wheel gap is kind of big, but it don't look that bad, honestly. So the queue is, is relatively dirty. It's not as dirty as it's been. So I'm about to go get a car wash and I'm gonna head back to Eddie's. I'm supposed to be there at 12. It's 10.45 and my car is gonna take like 40 minutes. So I'm probably gonna be late, uh, but I'm usually never late. But anyways, I'm about to go get the queue cleaned out. You know, floor mats, all that interior good stuff. And then, uh, yeah, so I'm going to take y'all along the way. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram, Frankie's Way. Um, DM me. If you're from my video, DM me if you're from YouTube. I'll follow everybody back. But, like, if you follow me and you don't have any posts or anything, I usually don't follow those people back because it's usually, like, uh, bots. So if that is you from Frankie Way, <laughs> I can't even tell you. If that's you from Frankie's Way on YouTube, just hit me and DM me. I'm like, bro, I came from YouTube. Hit me with the follow back and I got you. So... Follow that Frankie's way. I'm running super late, just tripped. So I see y'all when I see y'all. <laughs> All right, gang. Made it to Eddie's. So we got longer uh, self tapping screws this time, so this should work. Yeah. Yeah, so these should work. So we're gonna get these thrown on real quick. Already on the driver's side now. Pretty much done at this point. We are done. Appreciate you, Eddie. So now I literally get to get back on the road for another hour and a half. All right. I'm definitely excited to be working with Jalisco gang. Um, so to give back to y'all, man, in my channel, me and Jalisco worked it out to where I get a discount code. Um, at the time I'm recording this, I don't know how much it's going to be. Um, so obviously when this video drops, I'll tell y'all how much is going to be on the screen. But here's a discount code right here on the screen. Click that link in the description. Go to Jalisco's website. And go ahead and use that discount code, man. Get y'all some carbon fiber products. Get you some LED emblems. Get you all that good stuff, man. Use that discount code, man. Every time y'all use the discount code, it supports your boy Frankie. So, but other than that, I'm about to go chill, get some drinks and stuff like that. So, y'all see I had a Frankie day. I did it Frankie's way. And I hope y'all do it the same, man. I'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace. It's awful. I said it's awful. I'm getting old, Okay, yeah, that, <laughs> that's pretty fire. I'm not gonna lie. That's, got the extensions too, so it's gonna make it a lot wider. Yeah, know? that's pretty fire. <laughs> look oh, at, look at the flex. Look at the no, flex. Didn't, even, like, didn't even touch the door. Didn't even touch it. <laughs> so the carbon fiber mirrors for Tesla Model 3 and Model X are coming. Dude, that's clean. Oh, I don't want you to copyright it. Okay. And then the steering wheels for Tesla Model 3 and Model X. And these, we can actually keep the heated on them. So oh, okay. everyone that's always complaining about it. Yeah. All right, gang, if y'all got Teslas or... Oh, I think the big-ass diffusers are going to have two. Damn! Okay. That thing, like, sticks out like crazy. You know, diffuser, that's a truck. I mean, not a truck, a whole bumper. <laughs> yeah, it's huge. It's like three times the size of a Q50 one, so... Wow. Yeah, for model X, model 3. Hey, stay tuned, guys. He's got the carbon fiber coming for Teslas. There's going to be other cars on the platform as well. Just, just stay tuned. Turn on post notifications. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Follow me on Instagram. Follow Jalisco Carbon Fiber on Instagram. <laughs> like I said, we taking over 2022.